ahead and uh, freaking confirm that shit. But don't actually go fully into it. I just said confirm. Son of a... You already went fully oh. into it. Never mind, I didn't. Okay. I forgot you have to press the resonance thing. Alright, on three. One, two, three. I just shit myself. <laughs> Black screen. Are you nervous? <laughs> Is it that obvious? To tell the truth, I could barely sleep last night. We'll be going inside of my mind. What will it be like? <coughs> it's a bit scary, to be honest. For people who haven't been paying, what? Whoa, whoa, I didn't understand we were going to be this close already. Me and Winston are doing this at the exact same time in our own games. With clap Claire's cheeks. A brain fuck is in session. Oh. Oof. We're going to Mordor, everybody. Where's Calibrimbor in the rings? The death ghoul. Where are my rings? Whoa. This is an abyss. Unfortunately. Fantastic. Looks like we have a successful connection. We're over the first big hurdle. So this is my resonance area. I just put in the game, by the way, people. Okay. Both of your vitals are normal. You've got a background connection to your god arcs. Do you feel them in your hands? Yeah. They're as heavy as ever and visible at that. Just as Paler predicted. Paler Sakaki. Well, there's nothing but ash. What the hell do we find? There's nothing here. What is that? It looks like a person, but I think that's you. Sounded like either He's Gilbert or Soma's father. <laughs> phantom and a voice, huh? I'm not sure this accurately describes what's happening there, but one paper says this. Psychological phenomena may be seen in some form within the observee's residence area. We call them memory nodes, and they may inhibit access to deeper parts of a residence area. So yeah, that's one possible explanation. <laughs> it was a memory note? Huh. Yeah, most likely. Well, it's good if one obstacle is out of the way, I guess. Try looking around some more. <laughs> I'm just gonna run a... Oh. Here it is. There's two. She sounds a lot like oh, Rem right now. Same damn wine right now. Oh shit, origami in here? An origami? What should we do? Kill it. Ah. Kill it with fire! This is another memory node. Oh, well, no point trying to devour that. Well. Yeah, we're both fine. More or less. 
Well, I'd say that's enough for one day. We got plenty of good data from our first connection. Initiating disconnection sequence. Please stand by. Hmm. Time to get out of Claire's head. Time to clap Claire's cheeks. <laughs> that ain't what's happening. She'll never, you'll never get out of her head. She's always thinking about you. <laughs> if you are the main MC. thinking, what if? I mean, come on, man. The main menu, if you're the male MC, freaking Fiend's holding on to mommy and daddy's hand. The Nazgul, they're pulling me out. <laughs> Sauron. Oh. Sauron. Shut up. I'm gonna touch <laughs> Okay, the medical tests are all complete, and your levels look just fine. Neither of you are feeling sick or anything, right? No, I'm fine. Good, good. I think that the first run went very well. There's a lot to figure out with memory nodes and stuff, but more tests should clear things up. So, yeah, let me explain what we'll be doing in the next step. Since you connected with Claire's resonance area, your resonance sync rate improved. Oh, I put a document about resonance sync rates in the database. You read it, right? Yes, of course. You're always reliable. Let me give you a quick review. The resonance area connection you made earlier was a very shallow one. In order to perform a core engage, you'll need to connect at a much, much deeper level. To do that, we'll need you and Claire to build up your resonance sync rate. You follow? To put it one way, you'll try to match up your mental breathing, I guess. Mental breathing? The method is simple enough. All you need to do is go out on missions together. But not just any mission will do. You want to activate your oracle cells as much as you can. The stronger your foe is, the better the results will be. Anyway, that's all for today. Get yourself some rest so you can get to it tomorrow. I hope we don't have to go on a bunch of missions to freaking put the thing up. Yeah, I wonder if we can just team up together to do missions like that. Maybe hold on. Hi there. About what Keith was saying, I guess we have to work on improving our resonance sync rate. Whatever mission you choose, I'll be able to handle it. Let's do our best, okay? We'll be connecting to a deeper part of my resonance area. Let's keep at it, okay? okay. Good work on the initial connection. We got some very useful data out of it. Oh, by the way, about the memory nodes you cleared up in there. The analysis are automatically archived, so check them out when you get a chance. Now let me give you a brief rundown of the next steps we'll be taking. You and Claire need to increase your resident sync rate for a while. We want you and Claire to go out on missions in order to do that. So please take care of them when you're ready. Are you freaking kidding me? Yeah, we literally just have to do missions. Dude, come on. <sighs> so like, you want to you, you, you join up and go with Claire and... Gun destroy. Damn. This is gonna be really tedious. <sighs> yes, yes it is. Do you all know what's funny, Anim? We have to keep joining and weaving our lobbies each time we get this going. There's that, and we already did almost all the hard missions. Yeah, we just gotta go through a hard mission. Let's talk to the people. I heard that the origami in the residence areas. That's really fascinating. I wonder what types might show up in mine. Hey, so what's it like when you enter a residence area? I can't put it into words. Seriously? Is it that unreal? Now I just want to find out even more. Hold up, I'll understand when my turn comes around, huh? Oh wow, I'm starting to get amped up. I heard that you and Claire need to get to work on your personal connection to go deeper into her head. If you're looking at starting at going out on a tough mission, say the word and I'll go with you. Good to see you. How did the residence uh, area connection go? Perfect? <laughs> I knew I could count on you, partner. 
Keith told me that you and Corey are going to go out on missions together for a while. If you need another set of hands, just say the word. The residence area, in other words, the subconscious, controls a lot of what we do. It's ironic that we can't access it consciously, despite how important it is. Connecting to residence areas, huh? Digging around in someone's head means learning about them. And there are some things people don't want you finding out. So Claire's comfortable with you typing inside her mind, huh? That means she has must have a whole lot of trust in you. Gotta go talk to Hilda now. Talk to Fiend. I'll talk to Fiend after I talk to Hilda. This is gonna be a lot of cutting for these episodes too. You know, that's what Emo's always said. <laughs> Hello there. I heard the first connection went smoothly. While the theory was sound, there's no record of any test actually having been performed. I'm sure you'll be fine, but please be careful. Theme. I heard Keith talking about memory nodes. I wonder what they taste like. I can't even imagine. They're delicious. Oh, I want to know. Will Claire tell me if I ask her? I hope they taste good. <laughs> Hello, Sweepy Paws. It looks somewhat nervous. Is it just your imagination? Yeah, I would wonder that as well. Let me go into the- I ate Claire. Whoa. 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 Hold up. Slow it down. I'm only gonna speed things up, son. Ah, oh, crap. I don't know... Oh. Where's Bilda? For Lillian's eyes only. Alright, this is the memory data. My father was always busy, to the point where it wasn't at all uncommon for him to be go Oh, I should be saying this in, like, Claire's voice. My father- or at least try. My father was always busy, to the point where it wasn't at all uncommon for him to be gone from the port for days, or even weeks at a time. With so much free time, I buried myself in books in my father's study. Since he wasn't using it anyway, it became my favorite place to be. My own quiet space filled with the faint smell of old books. I had a brother. His name was Edric. He was busy like my father, but whenever he came back to the port, he would always make time to spend with me. He was gentle and kind, and I loved him very much. He she is said, a bitch. She says, had. Oh, they even mentioned Jeez. Wika in here, too. Okay, so me and Winston are going to go on these missions, so... <laughs> these freaking memory episodes or you know traversing the past episodes are gonna have a lot of cutting and I definitely need to read those like with you guys viewing it with me is reading the backstory in the database so anyway time to get on that I will
there you are. I was just looking for you. The last mission you and Claire went on together put your resident sync rate over the threshold. So we're ready to move on to the next step. You'll be connecting to a deeper part of her residence area, so make your preparations. Yeah, how about new? No, we're gonna max this out first. Amy, what are you telling me? That reminds me, Claire told me something. She said your teamwork was better than ever. Must be all those missions together, huh? Oh dear, there I go again. You want to know about the next phase of testing, right? Keith gave me an outline. Please confirm the details. Alright. There I go, slaughtering my meat Claire, again. Claire, memory, two. Good luck with the testing, <laughs> take care. Alright, tell me when you're at the thing, ready to deploy. I am. Alright, on three. One, two, three. All systems green. <laughs> Going into the Nazgul realm. Where are my rings? Daddy, the rings. <coughs> Don't tell. Okay, shut up. Okay, we're on residence area connection number two. So, is everything as you remember? Yeah, I think so. But it's hard to get used to this place. I'm already used to heavy movements. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I bet. Let's start off again with a little exploring. Ah, there it is. Wait, I freaking wait. Where actually? It's right in front of me. There. Let's see. Practicing again, Dad? <laughs> Your brother keeps getting better every day. He'll surpass me if I don't do something. <sighs> do what you want. I'll be reading in the garden. <laughs> I think I remember that. So they randomly got into some fight, did they? Wonder what happened after that. And what, is there only gonna be one mission we get to do and then me and Winston gotta go back to the grind? Looks like that went smoothly too. Hmm? Claire, are you okay? Huh? Oh yeah. I heard voices from the past in ten step a bit, I guess. I see. Well, this is bound to cause some psychological stress. Don't overdo it, okay? Anyway, great work. Be sure to rest up once you get back. Sounds like a plan. I wonder how many people are gonna, like, say, Oh, Gil from God Year 2 is Claire's father. No. I can it's already Randall. tell you it's not. It's just the same voice actor. Her father is a dude named Randall, according to my subtitles. Yeah. But people would guess Plus that before name is Randall. I don't know, but he's dead, obviously. <laughs> and she said she had a brother, so he's dead too. Gotta go into the database after I talk to Keith to read up on more of her backstory. That testing went perfectly, thanks. But I'm a bit worried about the strain on Claire. 
I'll, I monitor you both closely while you're connected, but keep an eye on her in there. Terminal data. No, don't database. Other memory node three. <clears throat> my father would often train my brother, and the thought of my brother surpassing him seemed to please father. When they were training, it felt like they entered their own little world. I used to watch them from a distance as they excitedly drew their swords and dueled. It seems my father and brother got into an argument. Etric had always exceeded our father's already high expectations, so it was hard to see him so discouraged. But at the same time, I was a little relieved to see the human side of him, even if it was only a glimpse. I see. So now what? Do we have the next one ready? <clears throat> You're gonna tell me we don't, do you? Oh boy. This is gonna be a lot of jumping in between for both of us, Winston. It looks like we're making progress. The resonance area is getting deeper, and our resonance sync rate is improving. It's not a big deal or anything, but the thing is, I keep having this dream lately. It's of when my father and brother were still alive. They... they got along so well. They talked about their dreams a lot. My brother looked up to my father. He worked hard every day to try and be like him. And I think my father was proud of my brother. I could tell he had really high hopes. But one day, bandits suddenly attacked the port, and my father lost his life. Just a few months later, I was told that my brother had gone missing in the Ashlands, losing two people I loved, one after the other. I never even imagined that could happen. Oh, it's a fact to me now. There's nothing I can do to change it. Just... In my dream, the two of them are always arguing about something. Somehow, the more memories I touch, the less sure I am which of them are real. I'm scared. If we keep doing tests like this, Maybe something terrible will happen. I don't know what that might be. But if something bad does happen, I don't want you to get caught up in it. Thank you. <sighs> I'm sorry to bother you with something so silly. But I feel better after talking about it. I think I'm okay now. Sorry for making you worry. I remember last, uh, the last part of this, I ended it right after, so I didn't talk to people yet. So I had to talk to everyone. Let's talk to Fiend first. Oh, I was Fiend, talking with Claire one night. Oh, how dare you. Claire said she has a daddy she loves. Everyone <coughs> likes him, and Claire has lots of respect for him. <laughs> Quit being such a douche. I know what you're thinking. All right. <laughs> All right. Man, wouldn't be the first time I was called that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what's up, Soma? You're on the next phase of testing, huh? Claire's been looking a bit ragged. In most cases, physiological uh, composites are created. Physiological. By... Whatever. Just shut up. Quit correcting me. Created Nerd. by <clears throat> created by uh, dramatic experiences in the past. It's traumatic. What? Okay. Encountering certain situations can cause their initial manifestation, which can be traumatic. Traumatic? 
Traumatic. Traumatic. Shut up. Memory nodes are... Memory nodes are those very manifestations, and confronting them can be taxing on the mind. Make sure you and Claire both take it easy. Hmm. If the testing works out, will you be diving into my head too someday? Thinking about you yes, seeing this and that it. about me puts me a bit on edge, honestly. Yeah, we'll be seeing you at some point. I think I'll once we get a little farther into the testing, your naked body. this gloom will clear itself up. I'm glad you're with me. You said I was with you. <laughs> Claire is showing s clear signs of fatigue. That makes me worry a bit. Still, everyone has things in their past they prefer to forget. Right, about the memory node analysis I mentioned earlier. There should be some updates after the last test, so check out the archive, okay? I already did, didn't I? Your resident sync rate with Claire has improved. Good job. Keep going on missions with Claire. Oh, we're ready to do the next thing. Claire told me something when I was coming back from work recently. She had an older brother. I never knew that. From what she said, he sounded pretty amazing. Turns out he was gay. <laughs> I wonder if Neil and Keith think of me the same way. No. Ever since I came here, I noticed that people on the ship tend to bottle things up. Not that I have any right to talk, though. Yeah, How's the no testing coming along? Right to talk. I'm worried that Claire isn't herself, or her usual self. If she's with you, everything should be okay, but just make sure she doesn't get in too far over her head, okay? Gotcha, here we go. Let's go talk with Hilda. What if I were a god eater and you were going to connect to my residence area? Just something I've been pondering lately. My subconscious? What if it's completely different from what I imagine? Hmm. She's sticking needles in her ass. I don't know what to do. Sweepy Paws is somewhat nervous. How can you tell? I don't know. Anyway, are you ready to deploy? No. Get ready. No. Damn it, I'm trying to find the perfect pants. No, it's not that time. I need pants. <sighs> I might as well stop.